Today we have a nice video tutorial on how to create a hot air balloon using simple things found at home. Let's get right into it. Here's what you're going to need. First of all, as you can see, you will need a nice sunny day. The brighter and warmer the better. Then as for the physical items, you will need a pair of scissors, sellotape or scotch tape. Any tape is fine as long as your balloon is airtight. Then to make our balloon, we will need not one, not two, not three, but four black plastic trash bags. This is to maximize the hot air to mass ratio, giving it the best lift. Now we will need to cut the bags so that we can connect them. Take one of your bags, get your scissors, and carefully cut off the sealed side of the bag so that both sides of the bag are open and it creates a tube. Do this again for another two of your bags, leaving the last bag sealed on one side. This will be the end of our hot air balloon. Our tubes are now ready to be joined, so put away the scissors and get out your sellotape or scotch tape. Then take two of your bags, line them up, and make sure that they are open wide on both sides. Then open up the tubes fully and put them next to each other. Slide one bag about an inch inside the other, then tape along the seam so that they are attached together and completely airtight at the seam. Great, now repeat this with your other tubes, making sure your sealed bag is at one end. You will end up with one long tube sealed at one side and open at the other. Our balloon is ready to be filled. It will need to be filled up with air, as much of it as you can. The two most popular ways are to run with the balloon open, filling it up. Or if you don't like exercise, you can always use a hairdryer. Either way, make sure it is filled with as much air as possible. Then close the end and tape it so that it is closed and airtight. It should look like this. That's it. You've made your hot air balloon. Now take your balloon and put it outside in direct sunlight. Because of the color of the black trash bags, your balloon will absorb sunlight and the sun's heat. This in turn warms up the air inside and as you know, hot air floats. So leave it in the midday sun to soak up its light and heat. Then after a while, you will see your hot air balloon start to become buoyant and float. As it continues to heat up, your hot air balloon becomes lighter and eventually breaks gravity to float up into the air. And there you have it, how to make a solar powered hot air balloon. 